We're back with more Memorial Booster, Cutie Pie, Chopper, Shrippums. Yeah, we got two boxes. If this is your first time here, thanks for coming by. Thanks for checking it out. Oh, but before we get going, I got to show off some Kaizoku cards. So this is Eustace Captain Kid. Uh, the art is by Phantom Arts. This is available, the uh, ST10 Kid. Kaizoku cards, I make these cards. They're available on my website. And I love making cards, so please check them out. It really helps the channel out. It allows me to keep shrippaming. So let's get into EB01 Shrippums. There's really just two cards I'm looking for. I was I've been talking about the whole time. ST13 Luffy. I'm so hyped on it. I'm 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 big. I'm a big cheese on the ST13 Luffy deck. But there's just so many good-looking alt arts in this set, like. Even the SRs, the SRs look great. Look at that, Miss Wednesday. That's a fantastic looking card. They, I feel like they just keep leveling up the One Piece card game, you know. And and what's cool about this set is every box you get three hits, which is crazy. We're not used to that. Usually there's boxes with two hits, but I think since they started doing SPs and stuff, we've been seeing more hits per box, which is great. Um, but this set doesn't have any SPs. It just has one secret rare. Bone clay, which I'm sure we'll see one of him in this video. And then there's only three leaders. So in a case, you're, I think you're pretty much guaranteed to see all the leaders. I guess you could get two copies and two copies of one. I guess that would be possible. I haven't seen it happen. Honestly, I don't really watch Shrip. I'm just Shrip my own stuff and see what happens there. But in the case we opened, we got two Odins and then it was a Hannibal and a Kiros. So, really cool set, Laboon. Okay, what does Laboon do? Activate main, you arrest this character, give one of your opponents. Oh, he gives something minus four. So very cool, Laboon and Brook work well together because Laboon gives minus four and Brook gives minus one and then kills a zero cost. So you can kill a five cost if you play Brook and Laboon and you set up a uh, 5K swing and a 4K swing in one turn. I love the way this alt art looks and with Brook in the background, it's just, huh, man, they're doing it. They're really doing it with the art. It's so inspiring. Makes me want to just keep leveling up with my cards. And it's been really fun finding artists, you know, that, oh, here's our Boncre. I uh, started working with this one artist, Uchiha Jake. His stuff is so cool. I'm so psyched to be working on his things. And of course, HZ19 is just the powerhouse of Kaizoku cards. That man is a true man on a mission. He is really becoming legendary. The, the amount of stuff, the number of designs we've done together, he is just so dang good. And I love sending him packages with all the cards that he makes. Um, and I just feel like he's really, he's really excited to push this stuff and he's passionate about it the same way I am. So I feel very lucky to have found him actually through like getting canceled by the Dragon Ball card game. I did a one piece card game giveaway. You may have heard that story somewhere, but um, yeah, I really met him through this and he's been my pirate man. Das Bones. We got three of those Das Bones now. All right, right into the next box. Box number two for this week to shrip them in this case. Still no flampes or violas. That's really what I want. I really, really want them. But I think it's probably about time that we come up on a leader. We'll probably, I think it's likely we'll see a leader in this box. Nonetheless, let's get into the shrip them ceremony. Oh shoot, I forgot the most part, important part of the ceremony is the bless them. Bless them the shrip them. Keep that over there. Uh, yeah, so just really fun set to open. I feel like the art just keeps getting cooler. I'm super psyched for set seven, and we're starting to see all reveals for set eight now, which also looks really awesome. The pudding leader looks dangerous. I'm worried. I'm really worried about Big Mom in that deck. To be able to ramp into Big Mom just seems unreasonable, especially with, you know, access to purple cards like um, bon Clay that just, oh, there he is, Odin. I thought we were gonna see a leader. Nice, sick looking card. Especially cards that like auto ramp, like Bon Clay. He auto ramps and gives you a really valuable body on the board. That, that pudding deck is gonna be very, I think it's gonna be very problematic. The, um, there's some really scary stuff in there. 10 Cost Mom is just such a crazy card. And you already, it's already, oh, Shirahoshi. 
nice it's one away from a playset on those which is nice thing about these cases is when you open a case oh, i'm just opening this bless them whoops uh what's really nice about opening a case of this is you get multiple copies like when we opened our first case if you watch that video there's a lot of double hits in that box i think we got like two violas which is a card that i think is very very good um and a lot of the other cards we saw two copies of so i think it's not going to be i think it's going to be pretty reasonable to pick up um alt arts for this set i'm hoping especially the bon clay i'm hoping that the price isn't too crazy there's another laboon Wow, two Laboons already. So we're out of, I think we're out of place out of Laboons already. So here's our hits. Very nice. This Odin is just so nuts though. Very, very cool. Anyway, that's it. I am a dentist. I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip. If you're not gonna use regular floss, looking into water flossing options, I think is a good thing to do. There is something called the Sonicare Power Flosser, which uh, is like a portable water pick basically. And you can just put water in it, take it in the shower and floss between your teeth with water. I don't think it's as good as flossing, but studies show that it is really quite good. So I think it's a worthwhile thing to check out if you are uh, not a hand flosser. Try it out. It's good to get some irrigation between your teeth. Just clean it out. It's hard to clean there with a brush. Anyway, thanks for coming by and I'll see y'all next week.